for all those cats that I was ballin' with Say rap ain't finna get my ass a scholarship And how come every teacher's motto is Music ain't gon' do for you what college shit for me That's the problem there, see baby, I ain't you on me Tonight I'm gonna party with the people that believe Moron, oh, second and eight. Ball is tipped and intercepted. It's Hufania who hurdles the man. Has a block. McIntosh, the only one back for Washington State, forces him out at the five. My goodness, what a play. And the third interception of the season for Talanoa Hufanga. Great matchup down here at the bottom between Phillips and Hufanga. See if he looks there. SC rushes for Thompson. Robinson's pass is picked off. And going to be taken back by Hufanga. SC has the lead. Touchdown Trojans. He's got an out route working against inside leverage. Well, Hufanga knows that too. So he just slow plays it. Just stays right at home and reads the quarterback's eyes. Is moving and they pitch it to him again. It's the same play. Oh my goodness. The Roloku gets absolutely pasted. It did not get the first down. But was there a whistle before the snap? Cougars back to work. For something to go their way, and it won't be them. Another play for Mufanga. Throwing Jameer Calvin to the turf. In the pass game, got to get him back involved. That's him in motion. They throw it the other way on a screen. How about that play by Hufanga? Ripping caught over the ground for a loss. It'll be third and long for the Bruins. Dorian Thompson Robinson of UCLA last week tore him off 364 yards, but they made the plays when they needed to down the stretch, and this guy was a big part of it. Talanoa Hufanga, the National Defensive Player of the Week, comes up with a sack. And just a great scheme sack here. There's Hufanga against Amuvai Laulu, and this is a mismatch. Wilkins on the keep, and he gets buried. Ufonga makes another play, and it's second down and goal for the years. Here comes Dixon in motion. Play action. Booting Huntley. Dumping it off. Fathering him. Put down inside the five. And guess who? Telenor Ufonga with another tackle. That is 13 for the safety. Gonna Cruz remains in the ball game. Pump fake. And they'll just eat it. The threat to the sack to Nick Figueroa was there in the end. Funga was there right off the top. Play comes back and they'll screen it for Benjamin. Eno Benjamin carving inside the 45. He lost the ball. Again it comes loose from Benjamin's arms. Let's see who's got it. Quint. The rolling on the field is a fumble recovered by USC. Wow. Book. Double clutch because of the jump and the pass is incomplete. Again, it was Hufunga who we told you earlier causes so much disruption. That was yeah, Chris Sims, you got to see that ground level, how good 15 is for the Trojans. Guy joins Shuck in the backfield, takes the fake off play action. Shuck in trouble, and Hufunga gets to him with a flag down. Telenor Hufanga from his safety spot getting the sack, but a set, uh, flag in the backfield. Holding. Travis Dye. Offense number 26. The penalties decline. Second down. SC rushes four. Down the sideline, nearly picked off by Hufanga. If that pass had more air on it, it's a walk in touchdown for Renard Bell because he was gone. First down and 10 at the 15. And they'll swing it out wide to Johnny Wilson. And Wilson met in the backfield and just pummeled. <laughs> I tell you, Hufanga threw the six feet, seven inch freshman down. Play fake and Bentley pressured, got away from Jake Drake Jackson. He's going deep. That one hanging in the air for a long time and it's intercepted. What a strange throw. Funga came up with it. Another Utah turnover. That's their fourth in this game. So here we go, third and eight again. Hunter Eccles bringing pressure off of the edge. Shut stepping up. He needs midfield for a first down. Not going to get it. Cut down by Hufanga. Hufanga comes out of coverage. Raymond Scott comes out of coverage and finish him right before. I guess we got about fourth and four here coming up. 
He's not the fastest cat in the world. He's not going to scramble. Yeah, there's a little Brady there, too, with that shuffle. As Yellen throws a jump ball to the sideline, intercepted. Hufanga cuts it back inside. There is a flag down on the play. Hufanga to the 42-yard line. So Talanoa Hufanga with the interception, but will check the marker. About a four-second differential. Lauren, well protected. Still looking downfield, nowhere to go with it. And it's Hufanga in there again. I love the way he runs. You said there may be better, more well-rounded runners, but nobody more violent than this guy who gets tripped up in the backfield by Telenoa Hufanga, the leading tackler for this Trojan defense. That's batted into the air and incomplete. Hufanga again. This guy was the fourth stringer early in the season. Now he's becoming one of the true impact freshmen in the conference. Seems like we're seeing more and more teams as a, a, there's a botched punt here as the punter acres by the time he got the ball there was a usc defender right there and he just didn't trust it he didn't want to try to punt it and have it get blocked paul lamal comes up with a football and usc will have it deep in ucla territory jordan Wilmer out of Londale high school here in los angeles gets Can't do it any better. Swing it out to Tommy Hudson, the tight end. Good play by Hufonga on the stop. Well, they'll try to run the ball with Cameron Scarlett and Talanoa Hufonga, who was a hard hitter as a freshman last year. That's a tackle for loss. That'll get cut down a little bit here as Talanoa Hufonga, the yeah. freshman safety, makes the play. Here come the run blitzes. Trojan showing blitz. Here comes Hufanga. And Figueroa finished him off. Clancy was talking about yesterday. Snap it quickly. Get it to Dixon. What a tackle. It is Hufanga again. We're down at seven at the 28 yard line for Gunnel. And he'll look to the sideline over the middle. And it's an interception. USC down the sideline. Hufanga. And he goes out of bounds deep in Arizona territory. He may be your best has, player on offense. I think he is. Utah's negative yardage in the quarter so far. That throw was not good. And incomplete. Almost really lucky to be just incomplete and not intercepted by Hufanga. We'll go short to Hudson. And Hudson gets brought down by Hufanga. What a series for him, huh? Hufanga basically shut down Arizona State that series.